Welcome to Footfall Cam. In this video, we will show you how to set up the counter easily by any handy man. Here are a few simple steps. Determine the number of device needed. Find the best spot for the counter. Get your counter wired and set up your counter. How many devices do I need? To know the number of counters needed, consider the width of the entrance walkable area. Remember, do not measure the unwalkable area. For height, it depends on the mounting height of the counters. Next, insert the measurement into the footfall cam calculator, and it should show you the number required and the gaps between the devices. Find the best spot for your counter. Select a spot that is free from any obstacles like signage and decorations. If it is unavoidable, use a wall bracket or a drop pole to make sure the counter has a clear view. For a sliding door, install the counter close to the door with a minimum of 0.5 meter from the entrance. If your entrance is a swinging door, the door may block the live view and affect the counter's accuracy. To avoid this, we recommend you to locate the counter 1 meter away from the entrance. This will ensure the counter live view will not be blocked by the door. Once the view is clear, fix the counter on the selected spot. Get your counter wired. Connect the counter with a Cat5 cable. Then, connect the other end to the midspan. Make sure your cable is long enough to connect the midspan. Attach the Cat5 cable to slot B. Then, connect the LAN cable from slot C to the router. When the power is turned on, the counter's light shall turn green, and is ready for network configuration. Set up the counter. We're almost done. Download the Footfall Cam installation app on your phone. Fill up the Analytic Manager URL and log into the app with your V9 account credential. Once you're signed in, tap Search Device through Bluetooth and find your device. Once connected to the device, the app will show the Live View Checker to ensure there's ideal position with no blockage, good depth map and enough tacking area. Next, proceed to setting up the IP details and binding to your company. Once you finish the setup, the counter's light will turn blue and your counter is ready to go.